Police Academy, they are um, before this, they are involved in badminton and football. So, when it was started and when the football thing started, can you throw more light on it? Yeah. Actually, I'm a parent of Abdul uh, Sports Academy, and my two kids are there. And they have started from a football um, academy. And they have, why I came to this academy is that they have good coaches. They have you know, coaches from Croatia, Armenia, all are certified. UEFA coaches, A-level, B-level, pro license coaches. And my kid, especially that batch, progressed a lot in within one, one, and one or two years. And they are winning all the matches and all the uh, games in Qatar, international movie. They went to Georgia, they went to Armenia. So I was quite impressed with the quality that they were giving to the kids. And they bring the Badminton Academy. That's two from Prakash Patakon. All the coaches are from there. And my second son enrolled to badminton and he won the tournament. Um, so the um, point of view is that the kids are progressing in the academy. And I expect same thing in the cricket also as they are bringing MS Dhoni, the brand name. Uh, they are assured that they will bring certified coaches from BCCI. So there will be advanced training, one-to-one -one training. So there is a, and um, placements and the selection trials and they, they can place in Chennai uh, Super Kings because they are managing that team, IPL. So there is plenty of opportunities for our kids. In uh, talking about uh, tie-ups, uh, so in football, uh, where can the kids, if they are from India, where they can play for uh, or any tie-up with any of the ISL yeah. club or they are, you are looking forward to it, um, See, can you throw more light? Um, in the peninsula itself, there was a news two years, two weeks before that the Kerala coach, Sandosh Trophy, current Kerala Sandosh Trophy coach, we know George came and see the facility and he was quite impressed with the skill level of the kids and he ensured that he will bring the selectors within uh, uh, early first quarter of the 2020 and bring uh, Bangalore FC selection coaches. So there is a plenty of options um, we have, uh, they are creating now. So they are bringing coaches from different clubs. Even they told, he told he will talk to AIFF or Abhishek Yadav, who is in charge of these kids developing the football and grassroots level. So let them come here and see our kids and if we are, our kids are quite... So, so in football, what is the amount of exposure they get locally in Qatar? Uh, in kids, from starting from U7 to U17, they are participating in Aspire Leagues, they are participating in Qatar uh, Foundation Leagues, and they are participating in QCFL, which is organized by the Supreme Committee. We have under-16 team participating in uh, QCFL. So plenty of um, tournaments and matches are there, and internal matches will be there, and the term matches are there. They go for uh, international matches, and the LI team, U13, is going for a specialized uh, coaching clinic in uh, starting from December 21st to 28th in Armenia. So yeah. what is the... Uh, uh, tie up with the Armenian people, who are the people whom this Absolute Academy has tied up in Armenia? Um, we have uh, pro different different programs in Georgia, Armenia, in Croatia we are talking about. So if we get uh, good coaches there to dedicate for our kids for 10 days, 15 days, so next term, uh, term 2 in this leagues we can perform more, but much better than term 1. And they are planning for international tournament in end of this uh, June, July. They are preparing a team. Thank you.